In this lesson, we will learn how to construct confidence intervals for a population proportion. To estimate the percentage of a species of rodent that carries a specific viral infection, 150 rodents are randomly selected and examined, and 84 of them are found to be infected. Based upon this, find a 95% confidence interval for the proportion of all rodents in this species that are infected with the virus. Then complete the table below. Carry your intermediate computations to at least three decimal places and round your answers to two decimal places. I am working with proportion and I'm trying to estimate the true population proportion of rodents that are infected with this virus. What I know is the sample proportion p hat is computed by 84 divided by 150, where 84 rodents were infected out of 150 examined. This ends up being 0 0.56. So that is my point estimate. Sample size is 150. I would like to construct a 95% confidence interval so that 95% of data is in, in the middle and 2.5% of data is in each tail. I need critical values z sub 0 0.025, which I find by using inverse norm, applied to 97.5% of area to the left of this z score because I'm adding 0.95 with 0.025. And of course, for uh, z-scores, mean is 0 and standard deviation is 1. This comes out to be at 1.960 as my critical value z and negative 1.960 as a critical value on the left-hand side. Now it is time to construct the interval using a uh, formula where my true proportion p will be estimated by using the point estimate p hat, and I subtract on the left and add on the right the margin of error, which is computed by taking critical value and multiplying by the square root of p hat times 1 minus p hat divided by sample size n. Let's enter the information we have into this formula. Point estimate p hat is 0 0.56. Subtract z-score 1.960 times square root of point estimate 0 0.56 times its complement of 0.44 divided by sample size of 150. Do similar substitutions of these quantities on the right-hand side of this compound inequality. Compute each of these expressions using your calculator. And when rounded to two decimal places, you should get 0 0.48 on the left-hand side and 0 0.64 on the right-hand side. It means that we can be 95% confident that the proportion of all rodents in this species that are infected with the virus is between 48% to 64%. Now I would like to demonstrate how to find the same answer using TI-84. We are going to use one proportion z interval function available on this calculator. First, we go to stat, then go to tests, and choose option A, one proportion z interval. Once in there, it will ask you to enter x and n, which are your 84 and 150. So 84 rodents out of 150 were infected. Confidence level of 0 0.95 is needed this time. Let's update that. And this is where my interval is provided for me immediately. Once I round it as requested, I get the same answer as I did by using a much longer approach you saw previously.